Welcome to another episode of the Kicking Throughout the Summer tutorial series where I teach you how to do one kick or one kicking technique every week throughout the summer so that at the end of the summer you'll be kicking like a champion. And today we're going to be not only just learning one kicks, we're going to be taking a couple of the kicks we learn and kind of start understanding how to blend them together. Um, and this is going to be done using our crescent kick, our round kick, and our hook kick. Whoop. Just like that. It's not going to be exactly that combination, but we're going to be using those three kicks to get uh, our bearing and understand how to blend from one to the next smoothly because at the end of this series, I don't know if I've mentioned it already, but we're going to be learning one of my favorite combinations that I've used to win competitions with. So with all that said, let's get that intro playing. What's up guys, this is Only Ninja wearing a video in a super row hat and welcome to the Modern Ninja channel. Like I said, today we're going over yet another tutorial series in the series and so let's get to it. But if you don't know already, uh, if you're interested in buying a kick pad, I've had these the, in the corners of most of the videos. I don't know if I've mentioned it, but you can definitely check out Century Martial Arts to use a, uh, to get a kick pad or a kick bob and that way you can have something to practice on at home um, whether it's in your garage or in your house or wherever you practice so that you can practice at home and get better at home. Plus there's a discount code NINJA10 at checkout and that'll save you 10% at checkout. You're welcome. But let's start off with our nice solid base just like we have for the majority of the beginning videos or beginning episodes of this series where we're, we have one foot in forward in front, one foot behind and we're squared off just like so. We're gonna start with our crescent kick with our back leg doing the inside crescent kick where our foot comes across and crescent just like that. And that's gonna be our first kick, bang. As we do this, we're going to plant our foot sideways to bleed into the next kick, which is gonna be a round kick. So again, our crescent kick lands and places sideways so that we're ready to use our other foot going right, left into our round kick. <clears throat> and again, that plant is really what sells this together. In order to blend your kicks together, you have to set up for the next one while you're doing the previous one. So that crescent sets up for our round, which will set up, again, placing our foot down, facing backwards for a hook kick coming just like so. And this is kind of like a spinning hook kick. Um, a round kick into a spinning hook kick. So again, if you haven't seen those videos about the round kick, the hook kick, and the crescent kick, go, go check those out because they're. I'm not gonna teach you how to do them in this video. I'm just gonna walk you through putting them together. Again, back leg, crescent kick, step out. Back leg, other leg, round kick, step down. And now we finish with our hook kick and we're back squared away so we could go the other direction and do something else if we really wanted to. Man, there's a lot of bugs out here. And you can do this for any kick. You could start with a front kick, still going into the same technique simply because it doesn't matter what kick you do as long as you can set up the proper way. Yes, I know, it sounds like a crazy concept, mind-blowing concept, but it is really important to understand in order to learn the combination at the end of this series. But keep in mind that you could also add jumps. You could crescent kick, round kick to jump, hook kick, right? You can add those techniques. And so uh, my challenge for you right now is to pick three different kicks, whatever kicks you know or have learned throughout the series and post your combination that you've been working on that you can do on social media and tag me in it. I would love to see it and in fact, I would love to feature um, some of you guys at the end of the series. So if you're enjoying the series and wanna be featured in the uh, conclusion video, so to speak, definitely tag me, post on Instagram or TikTok and, and tag me so I can see what you guys have been working on. But with all that said, again, this is a shorter one. I just wanted to get the concept of blending the kicks together for you guys so that you can start working on that as we do two more kicks and then put together our full comp competition winning combination. But with all that said, my name's DJ Moore, this is the Modern Ninja, and I'm out. Be the Modern Ninja, but left off. Just know I'm dangerous. Baby, perfect. <laughs>
I'm on that Bruce Lee, flow like water, state of mind Got me going farther than I ever thought I could have been Gotta grab a sheet of paper as you know I got the pin Anybody want to smoke your whole career be looking grim Out here flashing change while your boy been in the gym Watch me spitting flames while the frogs try to